I'm making a uh, video talking about uh, data matrices and uh, QR codes. Now, um, I think we're all familiar with barcodes, um, and you can and data matrices are really just a two-dimensional version of a barcode. Um, and it's it's probably a good way to store uh, information. You can create labels and put them on equipment and scan them and and then that scan will convert that information to a text which you can save into a, a document um, and uh, I'm just going to step through uh, my what I've discovered so far um, and share that with you so I've got the internet open and this is uh, just something I just did a quick Google search uh, QR, QR code generator and data matrix barcode generator and uh, basically uh, in this pro this uh, online web page you can type anything you want in here any kind of text and there are other uh, programs or uh, websites online that will do this um, so this is uh, uh, not the only one you can use and I've just typed in uh, this is a data matrix and it's generated both types of two-dimensional uh, barcodes um, now on Android you can download uh, uh, barcode scanners. Now I've got one called uh, Qu QuickMark. So QuickMark is the application and you can just simply hold it. It uses the camera and it's very quick. I don't know if you can see that but it's scanned it in and it uh, says text is this is a data matrix. So that's just what I typed in there. Now at the bottom I can select uh, copy so it'll copy that text and then I just simply tab across to uh, whatever document I've got open and just hold my finger down and press paste and it's pasted that text in there so um, now that's the, ne the next entry for the next scan now I think you can see that I can very quickly uh, scan these codes and what information is stored on the code quickly build up a little database. So this is a text sheet. I could have um, copied it into a spreadsheet. Now another interesting idea is instead of this is uh, King's Office, which is a free uh, office software creating Word compatible documents, Excel compatible documents. Uh, but you could also use uh, Google Drive. Now I've got Google Drive on my Android. Uh, so this is a Sony tablet, by the way. Um, and I've created, previously created a text document scanned asset tags. Um, now the beauty about that is that you've got an online document that you're, you're copying data into so wherever you log into uh, you've got access to that software and other people can see that and view that as it's been created depending on your shared settings. Um, so I'll just edit Of course, it depends on how good your uh, wireless connection is. Uh, enter and hold finger down and paste. I'll just delete all that. That's my name. And you can see this is a data matrix. So then that's saved on this Google document. Done. And um, there you go. So it's a very interesting um, uh, possibilities there with this uh, software and technology. Thank you. Thank you.